Welcome to another video of Word PLS video series. In this video, we will talk about how to install Word PLS. Before we move on to our installation uh, process, we need to understand that Word PLS provide three months free trial in which we can use all of their features. So there are no restrictions. And after that, if you still want to use it, you need to buy the software. So let's just go to the installation process. You need to go to any browser and here you're going to type what PLS, which is going to take you to their official website. Now here you need to go to this download and free trial section. But one thing you need to be very careful about here is that you need to be very clear if you're installing the software for the first time or you have already installed one of their previous versions. So if you have already installed their previous versions, then you will be downloading a very small file and that is going to update it. But if you're going to download it for the first time, then you will need to install a bigger file in which there, uh, there are two files actually and you need to install uh, those two files, but it will be done in uh, within the same file. For example, if you just read uh, the description here, it is saying that these are the users who have Word PLS installed on their computers. Users are advised to keep previous versions of Word PLS installed on their computers. They can simply delete the corresponding launch icon from their desktop. Download self-installing XE file from here, here, or here. All three are the links in which, uh, through which you can uh, download the file. But most of us are doing it for the first time. So if you are installing it for the first time, make sure that you download the file from the second links that have been given for new Word PLS users. Because if you are going to download uh, this file, current Word PLS user, and you are not a current Word PLS user, it is not going to run. It is going to ask you for MATLAB compiler runtime 7.14. But if you download this file, which is for the new Word PLS, PLS users, this is going to give you uh, both these files in one package. So what you can do is you can just click to any of these links and it's going to start your Word PLS. So you can click here, it's going to take some time and then it will be downloading your file. After downloading and installing your uh, Word PLS on your laptops, there's going to be an icon like this and which you can use your Word PLS. So after clicking this icon, it's going to run your Word PLS. and you're going to see this window. So make sure before you want to use Word PLS free trial, you need to select the trial license three months and then what you can do is you can simply go to proceed to use software. If you have bought it, then obviously you'll be giving the license key and then you'll be able to use it for one year. So just clicking proceed to use software after making sure that you have a trial license three months is going to proceed and now this is your uh, main interface of the Word PLS. Now in case you want to buy it, you can go back to their website and on the top of this menu, there is going to be this heading of buy license which you can click. And you can see the different options. For example, option one is one year individual license, and this is the price, and then all of the prices are mentioned here. Now, currently, the latest software that is available is the version 7.0. Version 6.0 is also there, so you can install any of these two versions, but eventually, in future, they will be updating it and then we will need to install uh, the new versions. So this is all about how to install and use the uh, Word PLS uh, three months trial. Thank you very much.